Hi everyone, how are you doing? Uh, Rena Golan here. Um, today I want to talk about why I'm not um, incorporating juicing um, and raw food only on the retreats. I'm not going to go into why is it, it's good or not good because it really depends on the person, you know, on the person's constitution, where they live, um, who, what's their personality, what's the season. There's so many factors to bring in to make a decision if they should go on one of those protocols. I um, studied with Dr. Gabriel Cousins in Arizona and I was very influenced by his work. And it's amazing work for diabetes, for cancer, for like serious conditions it can be very very helpful um but i also found that it's really hard on the body especially if you're living in cold countries and again depends on your constitution your blood type so many things that will determine if it really suits you or it can actually damage you so this is kind of uh, one thing that needs to be really looked at carefully and you really you know need to decide if this is what you want but the main reason uh was with time more and more i met people i realized that the type of people that attracted to those retreats are people that are anyway quite harsh with themselves and healing is a process of nourishment of softness it's like you know if we do this then we cannot allow healing and it's that receiving this openness that will allow healing to come through and this is why healing is not a process that is being alone and doing it on your own it is a process of support uh, it needs to be celebrated um you know the community and and the group what I offer in the retreats is nourishment. So I offer people a very nourishing diet. Uh, we work with breathing techniques that help people to move the parasympathetic nervous system where they can regenerate and rejuvenate uh, because as we know, when you are in the sympathetic, you only survive, you don't regenerate, you don't heal. And the other thing, of course, movement, and we do a lot of twists, and we actually just stimulating the natural detoxification process that is in your body. Your body knows how to detoxify itself. All it needs is that you stop putting pressure, stress, you eat well and clean, and you feel when you feel nourished and safe, then you move from survival mode to regeneration mode to healing mode. And this is what I found that actually there's no need depends on your on your condition. But most cases, and especially if it's just for a weekend, what people really need is to stop to listen to the innate wisdom of their bodies, like bears, they know exactly which herbs to eat when they're not well. The animals know, and we also know. And it's, it is about that. It is about creating a safe space where we can re-trust and reconnect with what is really right for us. And this is really what the retreats are all about. Our philosophy gave us this idea that it has to be ascetic. It has to be hard to be good and if it's pleasurable then it's a sin <laughs> and this is something I'm really encouraging people to move away from and to remember that life is actually very pleasurable it's okay not to overdose of course it's recommended but those things will be shared by themselves naturally if we only connect to the earth if we only connect back to our mother the earth and then we feel nurtured, then we feel grounded, then we feel satisfied, we feel connected, so we don't have to go to all those addictions that when we are looking for connections, where we are looking for um, to fill up the emptiness, right? 
this emptiness will be filled by us reconnecting with where we came from, which is the earth. We come from her, we go back to her. And when we reconnect to that, then we feel safe, we feel nurtured, and we feel happy and balanced. And this is what I wish and pray to pass on on the retreat. So I really hope to see you one day. But if, you know, this is things you can do on your own. You can just at least pray for that. Pray to be connected again to where you came from. Back to simplicity. Back to what is really important. Family, earth, food, shelter, deep breath and movement. Any of you okay? Lots of love.